Somebody. Hallelujah. Who's happy to be back in church? Glory. Yay, All right, now tell your neighbor. Well, welcome to church. Welcome uh, to church. Come on, say happy Easter, somebody. Happy Easter, happy Easter somebody. somebody. Yeah, praise the Lord. Hallelujah. All right. Hallelujah. Mm-hmm. Uh, Father, we, as we go into your word, we receive light, we receive direction. Amen. Receive instruction and grace Amen. to be doers of your word. Amen. Yes, yeah, that you speak to us. Amen. And uh, the word will bear fruit in our hearts. Amen. In Jesus' name. Amen. 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 So this morning I'll be talking on the topic when there is life, there is hope. Or you can say, when there is life, hope is not lost. It's a very popular saying, right? But do you know that life? is beyond breathing oxygen there are many in the world today that are living but don't have life hence they have no hope and can only motivate themselves to achieve whatever they want jesus said i am the way the truth and the life now let me break it to you if you don't have jesus you don't have life but you can receive him now All you have to do is to have faith in him, confess him as your savior and Lord, and invite him to take over your life and you will be saved. Hallelujah. The hope that this life gives us is beyond this earth. We have the hope of eternity. As we already have the deposit in us, the Holy Spirit. And our hope is not limited to eternity, but even here on earth. We have the hope of better days ahead. It doesn't matter what you are going through. As long as there is life, there is hope. Even if the situation you are in is a dead end. Is it your business that has died? Anything at all that is dead is not beyond remedy as long as you have life. Job chapter 14 verse 7 to 9 says, Even a tree has more hope. If it is cut down, it sprouts leaves again and grow branches. Though its roots have grown hold in the earth and its storm decays, at the scent of water it will bud and sprout again like a new seedling. Hallelujah! If the Spirit of God is in you, which means you are born again, death is not the end for you. Romans 8.11 says the Spirit of God who raised Jesus from the dead lives in you and just as he raised Jesus, Christ Jesus from the dead, he will give life to your mortal bodies by the same Spirit living in you. Isn't this great? If you have life, hope is not lost. You can stand like the prophet Ezekiel and speak into the dead business, your dead altar, your dead anything at all, and life will come on it. This is Easter. This power that I'm talking about, the resurrection power, was tested on Jesus 
So I will have full confidence in it. And so now, I want you to rise to your feet. Oh, speak line. Yes, you have to speak line. Speak line. Speak business, that dead altar, whatever is dead in your life, that dead situation, speak life. Speak life. Speak life. Speak life. The power that raised is still available. The resurrection power is still available. Speak life to your finances, to your health, to your academics. Speak life in the name of Jesus Christ.